said it only could ask. All right, are we ready? Yep. Okay, hey, we're back at Chaplain Chat, and I, uh, and everybody say, Chaplain Chat! Chaplain Chat! Yeah, right, we already did that, but we'll do it again. And uh, I have right here Alicia, and Alicia has a shirt on. Can you get that shirt? We got to read that shirt. And it says, I found Jesus in Unit 12, Bob Wiley Detention Facility. Yep. Yeah. Amen. Woo! Alicia has been on Chaplain Chat. She's been with us before. She was in our jail. And I want to tell you, she's not in our jail anymore. Amen? Amen! Yeah. Woo! And I want to tell you, she's going to... I will be back, though. Oh, <laughs> yes, I'm she, down. <laughs> she is going to be back. Uh, you have to be out of our jail three years before you can come back as a volunteer. And she's counting down the days right now. Her and her husband, Joe, have been giving out, doing hot dogs with us. Uh, Alicia... Uh, we've talked before, and Jesus was there in Bob Wiley? Absolutely. How was he there, Alicia? Oh, he's just all over that place. He's in the bathroom with you. He's in the shower with you. He's every, he was everywhere with me. But, you know, it was 5-13 of 2010. I had been crying out to God because I had been a drug addict for 34 years. And... Um, and I had been asking God, please help me. You know, I was destroying my family. I had already destroyed my family. Um, my husband, he's, he works for the sheriff's department. He's a sergeant. And when they showed up at our door, my husband was kind of happy. He thought they were there to visit him and they were there to raid our house. And, um, but you know, I knew that very moment that God had his hand and what was going on. I was so at peace. And I remember as soon as they put me in my cell, I fell to my knees and I cried out to God like I had never cried out oh, to him. Thank you, Jesus. And he delivered me that very moment of drugs and alcohol. I never had one withdrawal. And he just has done some amazing things in my life. Well, you know, my husband, when he came to pick me up after I got through serving my time, he didn't pick me up because he wanted me. He picked me up because he needed to scream and yell. He needed some answers for why I had done what I had done to him and our family. And uh, our, he looked at me and he said, What makes you think I even want you? I said, Because God is not a liar. He said, Are you freaking crazy or what? But you know, when I was in jail, God had promised to restore me and restore my life Amen. and yeah. restore my family and give me back everything the enemy had stolen from me. And um, my husband is my biggest supporter over there, and I love him so much. Hey, God bless and you. We need, we need our volunteers. We need our chaplains in the jail. Please, please pray for them, because that's why I'm here today. So, Amen. And thank, it is possible. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, we'll Chaplain. stop this one. All right. Uh, uh, Bob, uh, I want to bring Bob Kaiser over for a minute.